Okay, guys, so this is what we're working on today. This is your word work for this week. It's word study level three. You are on page four. So the way that we're going to do this, it tells us right here, when a base word has one syllable, has one vowel, and one consonant at the end, you're going to double that final consonant before adding the vowel suffix. So to help us, I wrote my note to myself. The vowels are A, E, I, O, and U. Um, every, a consonant is every other letter besides the vowels, okay? What you're going to do is double the final consonant before adding a vowel suffix. So here's your checklist. You're checking to see if it has one syllable, one vowel, one consonant at the end, and a vowel suffix. That means the suffix, the ending part, starts with a vowel. If it has all these things, you're going to double that last consonant. So they did the first one for us. We had hop and ing. And we, we needed to do the checklist. Hop, one syllable. There's one vowel, the O. There's one consonant at the end, the P. And then our vowel suffix starts with an I, so we have a vowel suffix. So that tells me, yes, I am going to double the P. So it became H-O-P-P-I-N-G. Go to the next one. We have chip and S. Okay, one syllable, chip, yes. One vowel, yes, the I. Uh, a consonant at the end, yes, the P. And then it wants to know if the suffix is a vowel suffix. Mm, S is a consonant, so it's not a vowel. So I know I'm not going to double that P. I'm just going to add the S, chips and fish. You're going to do the same thing for the rest of these. We have spot, ed, swim, ing, chunks, pit, ed, rot, ing, shedding, bunches, sprinting. And then down here, what you're going to do is you're going to separate them into two different groups. We have pets and we have foods. So they did the first one for us, hopping rabbits. Rabbits are a pet, so it's going to go in the pet category. And then the next one was chips and fish. So I know that fish can be pets, but I know that chips are like a snack or a food. So I'm going to put this under foods, chips and fish. Okay, so you're going to do that taking from this these phrases and put them in the correct category down here. Then at the bottom, you're not going to do that, so don't worry about it. Once you finish with page four, you're going on to page five and six. Once you finish page six, you can work on any missing work or you can do Lexi or IXL. Please raise your hand if you need help.